Oh my god, this is probably the hardest day I've ever had on daybreak. Every morning, I usually have an energy drink, but this is like the first morning that like, I just, I can't, I can't have it. Because I said no more energy drinks. No more. So I'm just like, ugh. This is ridiculously hard. I'm, I'm having a hard, hard, hard time. Usually like I can focus and, and like, Are you going? I'm cold turkey. Water, coffee. I'm. I've just. Wow. This is hard. What about you? Not a coffee guy. I. Yeah. I can have coffee. But it's, it's not just, the same as an. It's, it's not, not the, the same. same. It's not the same kind of zip. <laughs> it's, it's so hard. Oh man. So are we gonna see or notice anything different in your your vlogs? Yes, absolutely. So number one, we're going daily. It's not just every other now and then, you know, just kind of do it. No, we're doing it every day. We're going out trying new things and just mixing it up, you know, and uh, just kind of reminding people to live a bit more. We're working out. I'm hitting the Alaska Club. I'm doing all these, you know, different things. And yeah, so really, it's this is about reminding people: get out, live, live like hella. So, a new mantra. Day one. Live like hella, you, you play homeowner detective, and we'll just say that something not smelling right in your house. Take a look. It's weird. I don't know why this is, but this room, our bedroom, smells funny. It's not us. It's, it's, it's not we don't know what it is. We think it's something in the attic, so we're going to get up there and find out. And you get up there, you put your mask on, you, you <laughs> do some detective work, you crawl up in there. So what did you find? I didn't find anything. I, you know, I, I just went up there thinking, oh, maybe something died. I don't know where it is, but it's weird. It's not like that bad. It's just our carpet. But, you know, it was really, this is something we've been trying to do and, and we just, just never got around to. But a part of living like Hella is, of course, organizing, getting structure to life, getting things that smell bad or anything that's bad out. And so that was one of the things, and uh, <laughs> it was ridiculously fun. And uh, yeah, I came out of there. So mask, I know, right? <laughs> Everybody should have a mask like that. Come on, just you guys, in case. Yeah, just in case mask. I love that mask. But oh my gosh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. You know, I think those masks are very important in case there's a volcano. Actually, mm. don't we have a lot of them around here? Yeah, we yeah, sure do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Out, it's just across the way. Get your masks. So right there we have Anchorage, that's downtown Anchorage. But if you look over here, that is a volcano. And it is actually an active volcano. It's, uh, right now of course it's not going, but if like a really big earthquake happens, it might actually set off. And apparently that thing goes off quite a bit. So tomorrow we're gonna do something really awesome again. Well, technically tonight and all day tomorrow. Uh, so we are going uh, down south I was like, I had to remember which way it was. We're going down south to a place called Seward, and we have not been to Seward yet, but we heard it's really nice. Um, but Kristen and I are actually going to go out there for halibut fishing, which is super cool. This will be Kristen's first time uh, catching monster fish. I mean, these are really big fish. I personally have never caught a halibut. I almost did a couple of times, but I was too concerned about trying to get the shot. <laughs> and so I ignored my pole for like one second and my fish went bye-bye. Yeah, so hopefully we catch some halibut tomorrow. Um, but yeah, so tonight, uh, tonight we're going out there and because we don't really want to spend money on a hotel room and this is Alaska, we're just going to camp out. We're going to find a random place, a little somewhere kind of nice at least, and then camp out overnight because the, uh, the trip out on the water is starting at like 6 a.m. And it's not worth driving. I think the drive from Eagle River to uh, Seward is probably like three hours, I'm guessing. So yeah, it's gonna be nice. Uh, the only problem with that is we're not gonna be able to like vlog it for today's vlog. So we have to like combine it with tomorrow's vlog. This is one of those situations I was telling you, telling you guys about where like uh, we probably won't have internet. This is one of those cases. We have no way to upload anything out there. Hi. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye because honestly, I've got a fat headache and it hurts so bad. Like my brain right now is just like, I feel like my brain's just kicking my skull from the inside. It's awful. It's caffeine withdrawals is what it is.
just killing me all day today. Like I, I can't even focus that well. I'm surprised that I was even able to do Daybreak and make any sense at all. Like, wow. Plus we've got to leave for Seward. It's like a three hour drive. I don't know if we told you guys that, but yeah, we won't be able to edit or upload anything. So I should probably do that now and upload it so that it comes out tomorrow for you guys to watch so that we can continue doing this daily as I promised. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Well, technically tonight and the next day, but for you tomorrow. <laughs> Goodbye. Whoa, damn, I didn't do that. <laughs> Saying goodbye to sunshine. Saying goodbye to warm. Heading to Alaska where ice will be the norm. So much to see, so much to do. And the best part is we're sharing it with you. I'm there.